Good morning, I'm Mary Ellen, and today I'm gonna to talk about two favorites from the month of May. And I'm gonna talk about my family because they're my favorites also. My very first favorite is a collaboration that my dear friend Mary from the channel Glitzy Fritzy did with Sydney Grace eyeshadows. I'm gonna talk about the eyeshadows in a minute, but if you'll just bear with me, you may learn something new about Mary. I've known Mary. She was the second person I became friends with on YouTube, and she has been such a pleasure to know. In fact, Jim and I went to where she lives and met her and had lunch with her and enjoyed ourselves so much. But if it was not for Mary, I would not still have my channel. Back in the day, I was sensational after 60. That's what I started with because I really believe that life is sensational after 60. Loved every decade, but there's something wonderful about the 60s. And I'll know in a few months how the 70s are, but, but I, I can't imagine them not being fabulous. Well, I got a cease and desist letter stating that I could not use the name Sensational After 60, that it was already trademarked, and I had no idea what to do. And Mary, who is technically gifted, helped me do everything to get my channel name changed, and there was a lot of technical things to do. And that's when I became Mary Ellen After 60. I went, even though I still color the roots of my hair, or I have them colored every three months, I went on Mary's journey. Here's a, I'm gonna put a photo of Mary before she went naturally gray, and I went on that journey the whole way with Mary. She would be, in that picture, she was wearing a wig, and so she decided just to keep wearing the wig and just to see what her hair would look like if she didn't color it. And I kept saying to her, when she started to get weak, I would say, Mary, just keep wearing the wig. You can always color it if you don't like it. Because I just had a feeling that she would have beautiful silver hair. Unlike me, who's gonna be mousy. I've gotta get a lot more before I can go silver. But I looked at her channel and she has 37 Sydney Grace Sundays where she did makeup only using Sydney Grace eyeshadow. And Sydney Grace is a cruelty and vegan company. And also they don't offer affiliates. If, if you talk about Sydney Grace eyeshadow and you put a link to their website, nobody earns anything. They do offer discount codes. I don't have one, but nobody. But if you use the discount code, it doesn't earn that person any money. So the people who love Sydney Grace love it unselfishly. Several years ago, Mary told me she was already making the palette of her dreams, mixing colors, mixing shades, because one of these days it was her dream to do a collaboration with Sydney Grace, and it happened. Mary created the Blessed Palette, and these are the shadows I'm wearing today. There's a light version and a dark version, and I'm gonna show you the shades. But more importantly, I'm gonna link her video when she announced it, and she went through what, what all the shades, why they're called, what they're called, how she came up with the colors and how she wanted this done. There's not one ounce of glitter in here but I have a shimmer on my lid and I'm gonna get close. So you can see, even though it is a shimmer, it does not make my eyelids look any more wrinkled than they already are. So, and then I'm gonna talk about what I wore. I'm filming this on Saturday morning. The palette hasn't come out yet, but it'll come out the 7th. But I'm also gonna, even though I haven't watched it, I'm going to link Melissa 55's video. I saw this morning she uploaded one using Mary's palette, and I know it'll be great. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I'm wearing today. This is the light palette. And even though I just used it, you don't see any kick up anywhere. How I use the palette is I just touch it. I just touch it like this. I don't knock anything off and then I put it on my eyes. Today I am wearing Shy Guy. That's the purple, purpley blue that's on my lids. I'm wearing Pita, this shade right here in the crease. 
I'm wearing M-E after 60, which is halfway named for me, in the corners. A little bit of Our Savior. I blended right above the pita, and then I have Pop Nangi right in here. And I thought it created a very pretty look. I put on powder, I put, put on blush, I put on lipstick. Uh, I'm not gonna go into every, every color, but I just want you to see how beautiful they are. And I love that she named it Blessed because it truly is a blessing. And this is the dark version. And there's five shades in there that are darker for darker skins. The rest of them weren't for all skin ties, but there were five specifically for darker skin. But to be 61 years old and to have a company want to do a collaboration with you, that is remarkable. It speaks volumes about Sydney Grace. And I believe they will be blessed by having Mary create this palette. And all these shades in here, Mary created herself. She mixed and sent it to them and they'd send the, the shades back and see if it was right. And they went back and forth until they got the perfect combination. The palette has sleeves that just go over it. I'm just absolutely thrilled to death and I could not wait to talk about it until Mary sent these to me and she asked my permission. The only other person that I have accepted PR from is BK Beauty. So you know when I receive something, I always do a giveaway and I wanna buy it for someone else. This isn't a giveaway video because I'm going to be announcing $500 worth of winners that I used my own money for, so I've gotta save up a little bit, but I will be buying these. If a company sends me something and I haven't purchased it, I'll put a star by it. But once I've purchased it, I don't feel like I need to use the star because I put my money behind it. But I could not be more happy. I am thrilled, thrilled, thrilled for Mary. I uh, couldn't happen to a better woman. She, she truly has been a blessing to me and a blessing to so many of you. The price of the palette is $52. You can choose light or dark. And Mary has a 15% off coupon and it makes it $44 and some change. So I just wanted to make sure you knew that. Well, the next one I wanna talk about is BK Beauty. I love Lisa J. I found her on her channel. She is a was a professional makeup artist. She worked for MAC and I just started enjoying her videos. Not positive how I found her, but I really like her. And she started her own company. The name of her company is BK Beauty and that stands for Be Kind Beauty. And a percentage of her profits go to the Kindness Campaign. And I'm going to put a link to the Kindness Campaign because it is very worthwhile. BK Beauty started out with brushes, all different kinds of brush lines. Be wonderful. In fact, I have given away just about all of my brushes. And my daughter and her friends are thrilled because BK Beauty brushes are my favorite. Mary Glitzy Fritzy has a... Sigma brush set for eyeshadows. I still have that and a few others, but I love Lisa's brushes. I don't think I'll ever have to buy any more brushes. I take good care of them and they're wonderful. And I'm not sure in the order she did lipstick, she did eyeshadow, she did a, a collaboration with Angie from Hot and Flashy and created some great brushes there. Angie created them and done false eyelashes just all sorts of things and everything has been wonderful. Well, today, before I put on any makeup, I tried on all of these shades and for the video, I ended up wearing Gratitude. I love this shade, but I wanted to film it without any makeup on. I think I had on mascara. I tamed my brows down with uh, the ABH Brow Freeze and some navy eyeliner and nothing else on my face when I put the lipstick on because I wanted you to see how easy it is to see if a color is complementary to you, you and your skin. And I wore black for that reason because for me, it is the most neutral. If I put on white, my skin looks brighter, My skin, but my skin looks neutral in black. So I'm gonna go ahead and show that. This is Grace. It doesn't do anything for my complexion. It doesn't bring out any brightness 
but it's really good to mix with other shades. If you have something that's a little bit too dark. Many people would use a lip liner, but you know I'm a slacker. And I really have to think about it before I use a lip liner. But this is Grace. This one is Beauty. I can already tell it's one that I'm gonna like. It does something for my complexion. And I love the sh what she calls the shades. I just really appreciate something positive. And the next shade is Gratitude. Two swipes, and I really like it. You can really see what shades of lipstick you look good in if you don't have on any color on your face. I have on mascara. Well, anyway. Now, I saw Tamara from Tamara's Timeless Beauty apply this lipstick, and it really looked good on her. And we, I'm usually drawn to the same shades that she wears, but I'll put it on, and I'll, I want your opinion. This is called Empower. I can't wait to edit this video because like right now, I don't like it. But I wanna notice how it makes my skin look without any color on my skin whatsoever. This is Confidence. We'll see how confident I am. I think it's a beautiful color. And I know it'll be even prettier when I have makeup on. And this is Faith. Mm, it's a beautiful, vibrant shade, Faith. And one swipe and one swipe will give you this intense shade. It's very comfortable. It isn't as long lasting as like a long lasting lipstick, but I'll tell you, I, I still have it on six hours later. If I don't put a lot of gloss on over it, it'll stay. If I wanted to, I could do what my mom did. My mom would blot on tissue and then she'd reapply. And, and, it would, and her lipstick stayed a long time, but I just love the way these feel on my lips. So that's my try-on for you for her new six new shades. Something different she did is she this time is she put the shade of the lipstick on the bottom. The sticker it used to be plain, and I really like that. Her lipsticks are a very nice weight. I love the angle of them. I love that they are magnetic. And if you turn one upside down, you can get them to stick together. If you do every other time, like the sticker is here and it's not there, so now I'll put it not there and you can stack them. But I think that's pretty cool, but you know me, I like cool things. She also sent me the existing shades that came out, I think about a year and a half ago, I'm not positive. I have all these, I used up two of them, but I have all three. And I'm going to, at some point, put this in a giveaway. But again, this isn't a, a giveaway video. But I will order some lipsticks when I do that giveaway so I don't have to put the star by it. I'm gonna have to put the star by it today because I didn't buy these. And when I talk about the star, it's in the description in the show more section. Anytime if I mention something, like I said, if I didn't pay money for it, my money for it, I put a star by it. But congratulations, Lisa, beautiful, beautiful shades. And congratulations to Mary. I had my family's permission to put this photo in. It's me, my daughter Gretchen, and my son. And you can see we are in the middle. And I wanna talk about my grandsons. I've, I've just gotta brag. Number one, they are all excellent students. All excellent. Well, two of them are not students anymore. The first one, I'm gonna call him E. Uh, it's really hard not to use their name. He just graduated from high school and he got a fantastic scholarship to play basketball. And I can't say where, but it is a top rated school that has a, fa I mean, a top basketball program. He can't wait to work so hard and to get the, to earn the chance to play someday. He's also the one that plays football, but he chose basketball to continue his college career. But he's 6'5", and in these photos, the one next to him is A, and he's going to be, he's 6'4". Uh, you know, the way people stand in photos makes a difference. A is starting his junior year. July, the weekend of July 4th, football practice starts again. He probably played 85% of the, oh, 80 or 85% of the season last year in football. And he is a wide receiver and he is hoping to get to start in the game. So 
I always pray no injuries. I pray so hard before each game that there is no in injuries. A will be back to school away from home and E, the one that's just going to college, will not be living at home. He'll be living in an apartment. So he's excited about that. E is my son's youngest son and A is my daughter's younger son. And then there's my daughter Gretchen and me and Jeremy, who's kind of back there in the back. And the next one is A, <laughs> another A. I have a lot of vowels in grandsons. And he graduated from college in 2021 and got a job about a month later in his field. He works in with numbers and he loves what he does. And I think he plans on staying because he bought a home. He just bought a home in May and got moved in. He's single and he is happy as he can be. And he was my very first grandchild because he's 25. The next one is G. And G just graduated from college. He got his degree in business and analytics. He had one week off between college and starting his career and he loves what he does. G lives about 45 minutes from here and his job is within his area. And he belongs to my son, Jeremy, that's his oldest. And I know this is so confusing. And A is my daughter's oldest. So I just wanted to share with you my family. And now I want to announce the winners of my last giveaway. This is for a hundred dollars, an e-gift card, or a deposit to your PayPal account. So the first went name that came up was Deb Melton. Congratulations to you, Deb. The second name that came up was Dawn Lynn. Congratulations, Dawn. The next name is Zuli. Congratulations to you, Zuli. The next name is Shirley O. Congratulations, Shirley. And my last winner is Cindy Pass. Congratulations, Cindy. And congratulations to everyone. The winners need to leave a comment below. Any, everybody can leave a comment, but if you won, make sure you leave a comment below and then I will reply how you need to get in touch with me and let me know what kind of e-gift card you want or if you want a deposit in your PayPal account. It is all good. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much for being here. I, I appreciate you and you know that. And I will see you in my next video. Take care. In fact, but what people, but what a pe from, uh, so, uh, and, and in, I think, or third, one or the other, to get my channel. Here's what Mary looked like when she, not, I wouldn't,